Hey guys, Logan Manzanares here with Big Sky Barbell and today we're going over how to utilize nutrition coaching. And so with all of our nutrition coaching clients, we use a app called MyFitnessPal. So if you're on a, a phone or tablet, go ahead and download the MyFitnessPal app. And if you haven't already, create an account. Once you create an account, um, go ahead and click on the app and your information should pop up. If you're using a desktop, simply go to myfitnesspal.com and you can do this, these exact same things um, from the desktop. So we're going to click on this app here. Alright, so this is what you'll see. Is you'll see the, you might come to a home page or you might come to the diary. So. Uh, this is one of our one of our nutrition coaching clients that we're working with right now. And so, for uh, if you click this little top and you click today, you can there's a little you can tab back and you can basically see how many calories you've eaten in the last couple of days. So the very top you have your goal, which in in their case is 1,500 calories, uh, and you can kind of see what they what they've eaten today and how many they have remaining. So. We'll show you how to adjust those goals here in a minute, but first thing I want to show you is how to add food. So let's say for breakfast, we're going to add some food. So click add food. And as you do this for a while, you start to, uh, with MyFitnessPal starts to save a bunch of your food that you've recently eaten. So you can see there's a recent button here. You can see a bunch of foods in here. You can see the frequent. Uh, if you, you can save my foods if you want. Uh, if you have, want to put meals in there, you can as well, and then recipes as well. So let's just say that we don't have anything, so you're starting from scratch. So let's say that you want um, to put milk, and you had, a, you had a glass of milk this morning. So click milk, click the search button, and then you can kind of find what milk that you have. Did you have skim milk, McDonald's milk, whatever it is, okay? So you simply click on that, how many servings did you have? And so you have to kind of pay attention a little bit to how many servings you put in your body. Let's say for the sake of this that we had one cup. So we're going to put in two servings because two servings is going to equal one cup. Hit save and then click the little check button. Now, now that's one part of our breakfast. If we had anything else, we could go back in there and add more food. Okay. So let's say for the sake of this conversation that we actually had a cliff bar as well. And so if you look over to the right side of the screen, there's a little um, barcode scanner over there. So click that barcode scanner, and this is a super cool feature. And click that scanner, and then let's say we had this cliff bar. So put the cliff bar on the scanner, and it's gonna show you that, it's gonna, it's gonna automatically put all the calories and macros in there straight from the cliff bar. So let's say we had two cliff bars for breakfast. So let's just put in two cliff bars. Click that little save button. And voila. So that's how you simply enter food. Very simple, very easy. So now let's say you've been doing this for a while and you want to uh, see what your, what your macronutrient goals are. Just go to nutrition. And you can kind of see today, we just started entering, but let's go to yesterday, we have a full day. You can see how many grams of protein you're eating. You can see how many carbs you're eating and how much fat you're eating. You can also see this from a, uh, a macro standpoint, so you can get a breakdown of your proteins versus carbs versus fats and see how they uh, change throughout days. You can also see it from a, a calorie standpoint as well. So this is a pretty cool feature and you're really going to want to get to know how to use that feature. All right, the next thing that you're going to use in this app is the progress feature. So you're going to be um, consistently weighing yourself. And so how you enter a weight is you click the progress button and then you go up here and you click the little plus button. And let's say that we weighed, you know, 153 pounds this morning. So you click that little Check mark. Actually, let's go 154. Little check mark. 
And if you ask you to share a photo if you want to, you can. If not, just click not now. And there you go, it tracks your, tracks your weight. So, <clears throat> this is really good to see over the course of time what your body weight is doing. So click here, this little one week thing, this is just a one week replica of a body weight. So if you click this, you can see one month, or you can see two months, or three months, or six months. So, I'm just gonna show you six months. You can kind of see kind of where you started six months ago and then kind of where you're at now. So this is a great little thing to track your progress. Okay, and again, you can change that however you want. All right, so that's kind of, that's how you track your progress and how you do your weigh-ins. The next thing uh, that you need to know how to do is to manage your goals. So on here, you can, uh, your current weight you can put you can change your goal weight if you want to I'm not going to your weekly goals and then uh, the important part is know how to change your nutrition goals so click on this calorie and macronutrient goals and then here's where you can change your calories so if your coach told you that now you're going to be eat you're going to be eating 1400 calories uh, then you would change that to 1400 calories so on and so forth uh, for your uh, macro goals you can change these as well you can change them to percentages to basically get what you want to be eating for your for each macronutrient each day okay and that is pretty much all the features of the my fitness pal that you need to know so the most important thing is that you consistently track your food and that you do it consistently and you try to hit those calorie goals uh, each and every day so again want to thank you for choosing big sky barbell for all your fitness needs